Hi, my name is Gregor and welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be reacting to Spain's entry for this year's Eurovision. Nebulosa, I hope I pronounced this correctly, won this year's Benidorm Fest and will represent Spain in Malmo with a song called Zora. And now it's time for us to check it out together. Oh, it's an upbeat song and a lot of red color. Okay. Okay, it's in Spanish, that's great. I love it when countries are sending their entries in their native languages. She looks a bit like um, Kylie Minogue <laughs> from afar. I have no clue what she's singing about. But I'm waiting for a special moment that songs have, you know. It went from an upbeat rhythm to something calmer. But the public loves it, they're singing along. Okay. Okay. Hmm. I'm still waiting for the song to develop, you know. Okay, she's a good vocalist, dancers are dancing. <laughs> yeah, but... Hmm. Please let me know what she's singing about in the comments below, because I'm a bit lost here. It's really obvious the public loves it. It has also a bit of a, some kind of a um, retro bit, if I may say so. But it's not pulling me in. Oh. Vocals were a bit um, wonky towards the end, but yeah, um, I meant the grand finale of the song, but even though it's an interesting song, it's not my cup of tea, to be honest. It started really upbeat and I was hoping that it would go somewhere from there, but it didn't land for me personally. I guess I was just expecting that it's going to be like a really hot Spanish song, very upbeat and very cool. But it is what it is. I really like the fact that it's in Spanish, that's really great. So kudos for that. But I'm curious to hear your thoughts on this entry. Let me know what you think about the song in the comments below. And while you're at it, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel to see more videos like this. Thanks for watching, take care and see ya in the next one. Bye!